Hello everybody, my name is Ryan and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for joining me today to watch season three, episode four of The Bear. I am so excited about this episode because the last one, we were really like right back into it with the stress factor that we have come to know and love when watching The Bear. So I'm so ready to just get back into that feeling. But I will say we got to see the restaurant like many days going of the restaurant being open and I'm not gonna lie to you I am very terrified for my life <laughs> like I don't I don't know that it's going well I really don't I you know I don't know guys I don't know it's not looking good it is not looking good and that is frightening as somebody who is about to watch episode four it should be great it should be smooth sailing we should be killing it but we're seeing like good moments but then we're also seeing bad moments like um tina being stressed out about cooking and then obviously we saw richie drop something i don't remember what it was that he dropped but he dropped something like out on on the floor i don't know i've never worked in a restaurant so i i don't know like the terminology but out with all of the like restaurant goers the customers dropped something right out there which was horrible then we saw fac try to deliver something and he poured the tea and then took it away and didn't actually give it to them which isn't great for business i don't really know how that's gonna play out you know what i mean nervous nervous over here this one this one's nervous you guys obviously probably already know what is going on and all of that fun stuff so i won't bore you with it any longer we'll just get into episode four i was about to say season four we'll get into episode four and just go with the flow i think i think that's the best way forward here fingers crossed it goes great <laughs> probably won't but you know who knows honestly at this point nobody knows as always, the full episode reaction for this episode and all of the other episodes will be up on my Patreon. The link for that's down below. And without any further ado, let's just jump right in to Season 3, Episode 4 of The Bear. Let's go. It's Wednesday, but I really had to think about it. No, I had no idea. That's Claire. Flashback. Yeah. I have to be honest, I like Mondays. Mondays? Mm-hmm. Anything's possible. Exactly. Damn, that's cute. Your heart's beating kind of fast. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm great. I'm okay. Should we ask each other that five more times? Okay. Okay. This is quite sad. <laughs> Knowing that it just ended so badly. May I ask you a question? Yeah. What the fuck is this? I a really hot pot. <laughs> we must have really grabbed it. Cause it's really deep did it um did it hurt so much that it didn't hurt at all she um she tripped and fell onto a glass table and it just like it ripped through her and she had <gasps> arms and her back and her stomach and it was everywhere and she was bleeding and we, we were slammed so i read her chart wrong and she had a penicillin allergy, and she... Mm. It was fucking terrifying. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. So we gave her a shot of epinephrine, and when she got out, she was covered in stitches and skin glue, and... That's horrifying. I was gonna say horrible and horrifying. It is both. Uh, she... She, like, she couldn't stop laughing. I don't think it hurt yet. Damn. What a fucking ride that was, am I right? Holy shit. That's craziness. Yeah, here we are. Sad boy hours. That's, that's where we actually are at. My favorite time. <laughs> oh, no. I don't want to deal with this. 
I love Marcus too much to see Marcus sad. I can't. Just the noise. That's heartbreaking. Fuck. Oh, God. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Guys. Damn. Mm. Flower. Oh no. Why are we not clicking on that immediately and signing it? That has me shaking in my fucking boots. Sydney, what are you doing? Sydney, please God, no. Please no. Si I didn't like that one bit. One bit, not even a little. You should be opening that email and digitally signing the shit out of it. Why are we not? Cause he's doing crazy shit? Fair. I answered my own question. Okay, just say it. What do you think? It's, uh, it's great. Dad. Is she getting her own place? I want to say, like, what you actually think? <sighs> it's small, it's expensive, mm -hmm. and it's a longer ride to work. Mm -hmm. I think you could stay with me and save money. Well, I already told you I'm getting raised, so... But no, I, I don't know what's flimsier, these walls or the partnership promises. <gasps> oh, God. Ooh. Fine, I'm fine. Sydney, it's thin. Stop, you're just saying things. I'm not. You're not. It's interesting that it's a longer way to work. Well, you don't know like, about Trying to find a shorter way, a place that's closer. Cause I'm already signed the lease. <gasps> Sydney. That's a lot. Frank's taking you to the Museum of Science and Industry. What is Frank? What's Frank? Yeah, who's Frank? Frank's mama's fiance, baby. I don't know. Come whatever you want. But he's not my uncle like Carmi. No, baby, nobody's like Carmi. And you're by yourself. I'm not by myself. I'm with you. Not my... Oh, no. You think I'm alone? Mom does. Does she... Oh, no. Oh, no. Can I have 100 candles? Right now? No, for my birthday on the cake. Yes, in two months I will give you 100 candles. She's coming to the wedding. Auntie Didi's coming to the wedding? <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Spill. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Oh, Richie. Fuck. <laughs> I just want to hug him. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's devastating, huh? Yeah. Mm-hmm. It is. In case. In case you weren't sure, it is. What are you thinking about? I promised I'd see her before. What's that saying? Find Dee Dee before Dee Dee finds you? <laughs> is that what it is? I think so. Okay. Are you sure me leaving is okay? Mm -hmm. I want you to. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. To be, you can come down here, buy everything you needed for a full menu, all in one spot. Whatever grows together. Goes together. Hey, it looks a little loose. It's a little angly. Make it angle. Flush. Make it flush. There you go. That looks good. <laughs> Make it flush. Hey, yo, car. Come out of here. Help! 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 No, please. please. You look. You look good too. Is that a little choo-choo trainer type? Yeah, it's, it's nice, good. right? It looks good. Yeah, yeah. This is. They are fucking comical. Major food like critic. Like me. Every major food critic. I hate this feeling. What's going on, Carl? Yeah, what's going on, Carl? Take a step. That's how you do better. Oh. Oh, no. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, Take it down. This looks good, though. This is smart. Just uh, put these in a binder. Find yeah. the host to stand, okay? Yeah. Yeah, no problem. Thanks for coming okay. in. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Oh, wow. That was a lot. I'm proud of us. I'm so proud. Okay. Yeah. Impossible. I've already memorized every single one. I just, I just pray this shit. I pre-memorized. 
That makes sense. Exactly. I feel like Bear's starting to like respect me. No. No, like as a man, not a friend. <laughs> if because that's a lot of information for him to hold in. Yeah. He needs to let things go, and he would tell me because I'm yeah. his best friend. Yeah. And then I would be the one that probably told you that he respected you. Yeah, he hasn't said Just anything. so you know, he hasn't said anything. <laughs> they just kill every scene they are in. Every one. Every one of them. <laughs> I would work the window. Chucky would rock bags. Mikey rocked the register. Shit was like General Hospital. I worked in hospital once. Really? Many people died. Who does this man think he is? Is it all science? In industry, it's more fun than it's science. I guess. Oh, we're meeting Frank. What's up, Waldo? Waldo? Yeah. Oh my god, Taylor Swift. Oh. Yeah, uh, yeah, I did say that. Oh. Waldo it is. <laughs> I'm actually feeling a little bit nervous right now. Uh, what the fuck is going on? I'm gonna be sick. That you're gonna get punched in the face? I wanna to talk to you about something, but uh, I'm feeling really shitty about something. Okay, maybe not. Shitty about. Shitty about. Uh, I should have given you a heads up before I asked Tiff to marry me. I'm not her father. No. No, no, but man, I should have talked to you. Daughter is amazing, man. Oh, I'm aware. Right, and Tim. Also amazing. Exactly. And I should have been a gentleman. Damn. I'm scared. You know that, like, this could be a little weird, and I don't want to add to the weirdness. I want things to be good. How long have you had this house? Uh, three years. Your parents help you? I uh, know. Are you sure this is okay? All right, if he says no, are you gonna withdraw? <laughs> like. Hey, you're coming, right? Uh -oh. Oh, yeah, 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 I've been slammed. For you to tell us when we can come in. When it's perfect, it's perfect. Damn. My heart breaks for Richie every time. <laughs> every time. <sighs> hey, I'm Adam Shapiro. I'm the, uh... Oh, from, uh, Ever. Yeah. Yeah, hey. Oh, so good to bump into uh, you. Yeah, it... I know it's early, but I, uh, snuck into the bear. Two weeks ago. How did you, uh, how'd you get past Carmen and Richie? Well, they seemed pretty busy yelling at each other. I don't even want to ask how the food was. Chef. It was excellent. New, like, uh... L like, uh, not carmy. Oh, no. Thank you. I, I, I didn't think that that's what you were going to say. Oh, what did you think I was going to say? Uh, I don't know. I... It's been a long month. Ah, uh, that bad? No, just, just restaurants. Yeah. Guys, I'm scared. <laughs> And stressed. Every time I see Sydney, I just go back to the fact that she didn't open up the partner agreement and sign it. That scares me. A lot. Uh, the allspice, we are keeping that. Thanks, uh, but it needs great. more uh, heat acid. Okay. Well, Carm, that was the whole point I of know, the dish. I know, but we changed scotch bonnet, which mm. is also pepper. So. I know that it's also a pepper. That's not the point. The point is that you... And then if you want to change it back, you can I'm change not back. pissed. I'm just having a conversation. This communication between front and back of house is killing us. Mm, well, Rishi's out of his mind, so. Okay, sure. Carmen, settle down. I had not type and print up menus because I was told and she was told that the menu. In that time, did you tell her or anyone else that the menu was not in fact locked? that there would be a change. No, well, it's bad communication. Mm, yes, yes, thank you. <laughs> How's that going? It's been like three weeks, right? Four to one days. Okay. You miss it? Yeah, like every 10 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> How's your dad from the place? Uh, All right? Yeah. 
Here, let's go around. Go ahead. Over here. Are they cutting themselves? What's happening? I am researching the star system. Hmm. Yeah. I didn't realize you were into astrology. <laughs> Richie. I do not give a flying fuck into a rolling donut about the gastronomical proclivities of some dusty French tire marketing exec. Slowly, he began to realize... Yeah, that, that the rocks are people, and we're all separated. Yeah. Yeah. How we are all of us alone in this world. Yeah, well, <laughs> you know, his movies work on several levels. <laughs> I'm gonna go there someday. You should take Pete. Mm, yeah, I'll get back to you. <laughs> oh, she's almost here. Mm. What? Hey, what was that? Mm. She's got a lot going on. I'm just um, I'm thinking about how to not let what's what's in here. How to not let that get to her. Mm. Yeah, I think about that all the time. I got nothing though. You have any luck? I have nothing. <laughs> you think like it's better if I like back off? What do you mean? Mm. But is it confusing for her? Like, you know, everyone's talking about how Frank is the shit and like, um. Oh no. Richie, don't. Don't. Around. No. I, I think it'd be weird if you weren't around. Mm-hmm. She thinks I'm alone. Are you? Hey, did we make the week? Tomorrow. What's, um, what's tomorrow? Tomorrow we would have made the week. With photos? For what? So cut here. Yeah, Chef Cindy, a word. So, why is the Tribune coming to take pictures? Shit. Chef Cindy, why is Chef Carmen saying shit like that? Because we're being reviewed. Like tonight? Like they've already been here. Woo woo. Yeah, shit is right. What a win. All I can say is, uh-oh, <laughs> uh-oh. The way my heart dropped when he's like, oh yeah, I was in there. And you know, other than Richie and Carmen yelling at each other, please say psych. <laughs> Please say you're joking. No, no, no. I'd say the vibe was pretty good. I'd say I'm gonna have a fucking heart attack. That's, I mean, I guess the main thing, the most important thing is that the food was good and they said the food was good. So that's pretty good, but, <sighs> Oh man. Oh man, it's not gonna be good. Especially then you have Fac, who's like, no worries guys, I got them all memorized in here. So I would have already known if they've been in here because I'm just incredible. Fac, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? You didn't help us, buddy, <laughs> at all. God, that's so bad. And I am stressed, like, I feel like I understand. I feel like I'm on the, correct train of thought with why Sid has not signed the agreement, but it doesn't make it feel any more okay. I'm still very concerned about that. Overall, I do always, always have a great time with whatever scene is going on if the facts are involved. They just, I don't know. I don't know if it's the way they act in the scenes, like just feels so funny and so like them trying to be nonchalant about stuff and 
it just hits every time. I don't know exactly what it is, but it's a great time all the time, if I do say so myself. Marcus is breaking my heart. I feel like, I don't know, seeing him turn on the machine so he could hear the noise and mm, that's gonna like freaking break my heart right now and then same thing with Richie and his daughter like saying that she thinks he's alone and stuff and then him telling Matt about that I feel like honestly <laughs> I feel like Richie oh my god he just breaks my heart he's come so far as a human like in the last season especially really turned it around right in forks that episode and it's just i feel like really taking the steps to just try and better himself and then hearing all of that and stuff obviously is not the easiest thing to hear but it's just heartbreaking especially when you see it getting to him because he is like when i was like well are you he is he is both alone and lonely i'm sure especially after what he had and then the conversation where he was like basically saying should I just step out of the picture and let my daughter kind of have that family with Frank and stuff like that that was heartbreaking because it's like no Rich you should not do that that's not fun for the child <laughs> that is not a good time for the child at all so don't do that she loves you she needs you you are her father I did find it interesting like I didn't know what the fuck Frank was getting at or what he was saying I was so confused there for a minute and then just to have him be like I should have asked you like or let you know like yeah maybe you probably should have that way it wasn't you know so un not it wasn't even uncomfortable like because Tiff told him but it's like it's sad but at least then he would have like had time to kind of prepare for when she called and told him and then he could be like oh I know but I don't know like Frank does seem like a good guy he's got his stuff together all of that so it's a good situation for her and his daughter but it is just a sad situation all in all so you know just sad times sad times all around I am looking forward to the next episode. Sydney's now living alone. And the fact she hasn't signed this fucking agreement is, like, gonna make me sick to my stomach. But Carmi really does need to get the communication under control. So, like I said, I understand, like, if that's the vibe she's feeling, why she's not. I get it. And I back her on that. But it is upsetting to me. Deeply. Deeply so. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode with me. As always, the full episode reaction for this episode and all the other episodes will be up on my Patreon. The link for that's down below. And I'll see you guys back here with me for the next episode. Bye, guys.